And tonight is a little different because tonight uh, we're going to celebrate, this is our 100th performance of Be More Chill. Uh, and in addition to that, tonight is the 40 year anniversary of the opening night of Be More Chill at Two River Theater in New Jersey, where we started. Uh, so we feel like there's lots of uh, Be More Chill vibes in the universe this evening. Uh, so what we're going to do for you is we're going to do uh, snippets from three uh, songs that were cut from Be More Chill at various points in its life over the past four years. Uh, so this is like, uh, like, like very rarely heard or in some cases never before heard material that you're gonna hear tonight. Uh, we're gonna do three, uh, three little snippets for you and here to sing the first snippet, uh, two people you know very well, put your hands together for Will Rowland and Lauren Marcus. So, um, Will, Will and Lauren are gonna sing this song called, uh, or part of this song called Touching My Hand. And the idea behind this song was, this used to be the second song in the show. So you know the scene when, uh, when Jeremy and Christine are in, the, in play practice? Uh, it's where Christine now sings I Love Play Rehearsal. And that song used to be later, and, and this song uh, held the spot. And this was sort of the first time Jeremy and Christine interacted. And um, it, the whole thing started when they were, you know, they were talking, and, uh, and Christine's hand brushes Jeremy's hand, and time stops. <laughs> she is touching my hand. She is touching my hand. She is touching my, touching my, touching my hand. She is touching my hand, I do not understand What's the reason she seems to be touching my hand? Maybe this means she doesn't despise me She doesn't despise me and wants me to know The level of comfort she feels when she's near me Just makes her sincerely wanna never let me go If her hand is willing, cool and fine To just be chilling next to and it's feeling what I feel I'm not projecting when I say Since we're connecting in this way I'll probably definitely get with her for real I'll probably definitely get with her for real <laughs> my mic. So the scene goes on, the scene goes on, and uh, Jeremy sings some more, he gets in his head, and then Jake comes in. Jake has a moment with Christine where he tells her that he loved her in that school play where she died, and then Christine sort of goes into her own internal place. He said I was good, not just in it, but good. Always found a lame, all the same, he said I was good. So more song happens, more scene happens, Jeremy's really dejected. Christine is contemplating her relationship with Jake, and they're both in their own worlds, but on the stage together. If I was brazen like those guys, when she would gaze into my eyes, and the look in them would reveal, I'm fun and more and worth a damn, or at least I sorta think I am. I am never gonna get with her for real If she not is interested in him And he can win her on a will I ever really get Then I am never gonna get with her for real Not overstating when I say That this has been a suck ass day And I just wanna hide away And just forget the whole ordeal Since I am never gonna I'm glad we got to perform it on Broadway. I think it's cute. It's like a little bit creepy, but mostly cute. Uh, this next Jason's Me Too Boys. Uh, and so this was a song that the dad had in the first act, 
And I loved the song so much. The whole song is less than a minute long, but it was cut because we found it uh, redundant. Um, but uh, you, I guess you'll see why. The name of the song is The No Pants Song. No pants are pants enough for me. That song I wrote was just sung on Broadway. Um, and you know, I, I realized I was supposed to say at the beginning of this thing that if anyone's allowed to film, if anyone wants to film, you're allowed to film. But I think that there was something in me that told me, why don't you say that after the No Pants song is performed? <laughs> Um, okay, and we got one more tune for you. This is actually a song that's in the show. Uh, it opens the second act. It's called Halloween. And for Broadway, I wrote this much longer ending to it. It was sort of like a big Broadway finish. Uh, and uh, we found out once we got into performances, it was simply too long. Uh, but you're going to hear it tonight. Uh, so here is the cut ending of Halloween. Everyone, come on. Give it a count. Oh, a two. Oh, one, two, three, four. Everyone's got a red solo cup Fill it up, fill it up Hear the beer spill on the ground Everybody's all like so No man's up, let's catch up, let's smoke up Look how many drinks are down It's a song all I want, where I want, where I go Turn it up as we stumble to the sound Cause the Halloween party's a rad excuse To put your body through mad abuse Thank you.